What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to my mini series, so to speak, on Mr. Grinch. So I've been doing a couple of videos. Whichever one of these you are watching at this moment is part of a four-part series. I am doing Voctive, Pentatonix, Small Town Titans, and of course this video you're watching, which is voice play. I'm doing my best to get them all out and into some kind of playlist so you guys can check them all out at the same time in one of my first mini-series specials because it's Christmas and I like the decor and I just wanted an excuse to do it. This time around, we're gonna check out Mr. Grinch. Before we get started, if you are new or returning to this channel, thank you ever so much for spending time with me. Please like, comment, subscribe, click that bell below, and leave me comments below. I love to get in the chat with you guys and see what's going on. Don't forget, we do have a Patreon page set up for you as well. If you're so inclined to join something like that, it is meant for any videos that get blocked or denied from YouTube, I put them up over there. As well as you typically get exclusive content and videos like this just a little bit early than everybody else. We also have a Discord community if you're into talking music with us where we make general asses of ourselves and we jump into that chat all the time to say hey so come join the conversation so to speak links to all of that will be in the description below as well as an address to our PO box if you guys want to send me anything for an un unveiling or an open boxing or even if you want to just send a postcard of some kind I typically respond to every letter I get bear with me because I tend to nerd out really hard over how low Jeff goes but we're gonna see what we got I got my headphones right here I've got voice play right there and I've got you guys right here magic finger does the work let's watch it go <laughs> 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 Uh, I love that these guys get theatrical and do all of the like the costumes and whatnot. So then I said, so then I said, listen, listen, listen. So then I said, hey Grinch, you're a triple decker sauerkraut and toadstool sandwich. Yeah. Okay. With arsenic sauce. Oh, 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 that's the very worst kind of sandwich. I know. It's disgusting. <laughs> this this is painful. Not gonna lie. Too <laughs> funny. Too funny. Guys. <laughs> I think we're on. Uh -oh. yeah. The cameras are rolling. Here we go. One, two, three, and... Do -do -do. from the movie, right? Welcome Christmas, Christmas, Christmas Day! Hey. Oh, where are you going? Well, you were flat. Oh my god, the resonant bass sound. Oh my god. my boy you really are a heel you're as cuddly as a cactus you're as charming as an eel mr grinch you're a bad banana with the greasy black peel mr groove is so sick you're a monster mr grinch your heart's an empty hole You got garlic in your soul, Mr. Grinch. And I wouldn't touch you with a foot oh. You're a one one. Max like the dog Max from the movie. <laughs> Mr. Grinch. You got to I'm gonna rewind that one to pick up on her on her downbeat. Your brain is full of spiders. You got garlic in your soul, Mr. Grinch. They have like a more uh, late 90s, early 2000s R&B vibe with their harmony choice and even their percussive sounds. It's very interesting to me because they do that and they bring it into 2020 like this really nice. Although this wasn't shot in 2020, I know, but like they, they have that. You guys hear what I'm hearing? You have all the tender sweetness of a seasick crocodile, Mr. Grinch. Wow. And given the choice between the two, I'll take the seasick crocodile. Mr. Grinch. More rapid than legals, his coursers, they came and he whistled and shouted and called him by name. Hello. 
my name. <laughs> oh, um, um, on Max. Wolf. You're pathetic. From the top of the Who plays the Grinch? Can you guys let me know, please? Move to the top of the You're a foul one, Mr. Grinch. Yeah, you're a nasty, wasty skunk. Yeah, very, very like late 90s, 2000 pop star, right? Very much. You are as follows. And I quote. Stink. Ew. Stink. Gross. Stung. You need a bag. This is amazing. That's called a retardando when they slow it down like that, and that was masterfully done. You should all rewind that like I'm about to and listen to how well they did that. Wow. I like how Jeff is so low, it basically sounds like I've blown my speakers. I love it. Amazing. Amazing. Let's talk. So if you're watching this now, this is the end part of my four-part series on Mr. Grinch. Four versions of Your Mean One, Mr. Grinch, involving Voctiv, uh, Pentatonix, Small Town Titans, and now this one you're watching tonight with is voice play. So wherever you are, whatever you're doing, try and find the playlist of all of them and compare them yourselves. I noticed some insane differences. Some similarities, yes, but the differences is the spice of life, and that's what I love. What's so cool when doing it this way was I was able to hear all of their just epicness that each of these groups are known for being drawn out in this wicked style. So voice play is fantastic at using the lower registers because they have Jeff that's going that crazy low. But what they do is they don't sit there and just go like blah and make it sit there. They'll make the low register move. Your ear perceives that movement kind of like I guess uh, a silly a silly metaphor would be like that old game Alleyway, which used to move like this, and you would shoot the, the ball and it would hit the stuff. Alleyway would be insanely like boring if it just sat there. This is similar to a low register note. We consider a low register note like the foundation or the base, no pun intended, but the foundation of something. If it just sits there and doesn't move, our ear goes, okay, that's kind of cool, and we pay attention to the higher stuff. But what voice play does is they move that and it's so neat. If you dissect notes singularly of uh, each of these parts, you'll notice they're choosing cool notes and making a fun melody out of it. There's still some cool pocket feel changes that are so, so cool. Again, because acapella, they're gonna require on the voice to do a lot of the percussion sounds, which is completely fine. That was rad as well. And I like the theatrics, dressing up like people in Whoville, starting the song with that classic so song from uh, the Grinch movie. Even taking the Grinch motif that Jim Carrey portrayed in that amazing Ron Howard film. It's, it's fun. Interjected with these funny little skits like the French waiter or giving him Max's dog poop in a, in a 
brown paper bag. This makes it fun. Let's not take away, though, from the epicness of the musical performance and the rearrangement of it. Can you let me know in the comments below who arranged this one? Guys, I hope you like this video as much as I loved reacting to it. This concludes my mini-series on the Mr. Grinch song for Christmas, hence the Santa hat, the fireplace, and all the fun lights. So please, do yourself a favor and high five yourself if you were one of the people that recommended this one because it has been uncannily awesome. And this was a fun little thing I did, kind of did off the cuff. So please try and find the playlist or the other videos. It is a four part series on this one. I would love to see what you guys have to say about all of those videos combined. Please like, comment, subscribe, click the bell, follow us on Patreon. You can see links to all of it below, plus the Discord channel where we're talking, and we do live streams every Monday night at 8 p.m. PST. And if you want to send me anything in the mail, there's a, an address below as well. You can get me to do an unboxing or an unveiling or whatever you guys would like, or even just a straight-up postcard is completely fine with me. I hope wherever you are and whatever you're doing, you're kicking ass and taking names. Watch it go.